Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my vault, all right? Um, this didn't start out. This wasn't my plan, okay? I didn't plan to have a bunch of shit masterwork in my vault. I, I mean this because if I go into my dim right now and I search for things that are masterwork, let's go to my display here, all right? If I go to like things that are masterwork, this armor is exotic, it's masterwork. I have 508 items currently, right? That, that wasn't really my goal. I just started doing like grandmaster help. And here's what happened. I noticed that Bungie put a cap of 10 on my character. And then each character have 10 at, you know, at the postmaster. Over time, I lost, I lost a bunch of shards all the time because like I would just be doing grandmaster help and I, you know, I lost prisms, I lost shards. I lost maybe over like 500 shards, maybe more. Um, so then I was like, you know, F it. I'm gonna start master working exotics and just throw it in the vault. All right, let's see how it goes. Uh, if you look up top somewhere up there, right? It shows like 1,569 GMs completed. If you're guaranteed a shard or two per GM completions, right? You do that times one, that's still like basically more than how many things I master work. You, you do that times two, that's like 3,000 something shards. You do that times four, because we get like the double loot. Sometimes you get like up to four shards. The number is stupid. All right. Um, but I remember Toes was like, yo, let me see like what roles you have and stuff like that. Right. So I'm just going to skim through it real quick. The highest I ever got was a 72 and I think I deleted it. Okay. It was like Aeon Souls or something like that. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to like skim through each one and kind of go through. Also like this game is supposed to be an MMO, right? Why are we like limited to things? I don't get it. And why is 10 the number? Doesn't make any sense. All right, so here we go. Um, I'm going to be honest here. I got a lot of exotics in this game. And I got to say my RNG sucks. Because a lot of this shit has terrible fucking rolls. Okay, but here we go. No. 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 This is okay. No, no. Actually, this isn't bad. This is like 12, 22, 23. And the one that I normally use all my character is 2018 for uh, mobility and discipline. All right. No, no, no. I mean, you see the pattern, right? Why is like most of these things balanced? I, I don't get it. You get a piece of armor, it has high stats, and it's balanced out. Oh, it's weird. This worm is actually not bad. Because it came with mobility and intellect, and I don't need recovery because worm husk is gonna give me recovery, right? So that's not bad. No. Eh. Alright, let's see what what's like the highest stat I have. Look at all these Nighthawks, right? I barely have any with intellect. Yikes, bro. Just unlucky, I guess. But you can kind of see the pattern here. Look at this. Like, look, this, this is like balanced out gear. And this is from coming from someone who like plays the game a lot. You know, I don't see anything too crazy here. To me, it's just a bunch of junk, and maybe one day Bungie will be like, all right, cool, you guys can have a bunch of shards, and I might just delete these, right? Or we might end up getting, like, uh, what is it, like, materials, maybe? This crowd temp is not bad. 29 recovery. But, damn, that's a lot of fucking recovery. Because then if I put it to like that 29, 26. Resilience and select. Twenty three, twenty one. I don't know. Twenty three, twenty two. A lot of these do like end up in good stats, and some of them are just like no. Apathy is well. I have a bunch of good rolls for this. I think twenty three, twenty five, twenty three, twenty five. Like back to back. Twenty five, eighteen. How come the one that I I'm never going to use has like twenty four, twenty three? 
some of the best fucking stats on it. This is a base 70 because this is 82. Yet, like, all of this shit is just like in the wrong place. Like, what is this? Look at this. Like, come on, man. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I have something here that like matches someone's like play style. I just don't see it. Felwins and Helm came with eh, 30 shrimp. It's not bad. I'm just looking at it like these rolls are terrible. <sighs> Look at these Aeons though. Recovery intellect. These are some terrible Aeons actually. Holy Jesus. Nope. Hey, all right, let me see. Do I have any shards with intellect? Okay, those are all right. That's a lot of recovery on some shards. Ah, uh, that's not too bad, I guess. I don't see anything special. Ah, uh, that's okay. I'm never going to use it. Liar's handshake. It's a lot of strength right there. You would think like an exotic that gives you like, you know, grenade energy, like uh, these bad boys right here. Hopefully I have one with like some cracked out discipline. Uh, I still don't see anything too crazy. I'm like, oh my God, this roll is like perfect. Uh, any Shinobus with good discipline yet? 18 is the highest I saw. Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. 22. With 25 recovery. That's not bad, actually. This might be better, even though it doesn't have much discipline on there. Looking, looking, looking. I haven't seen anything special. I might just do a dismensling uh, thing one day when they allow us to just have a uh, a crazy amount of shards because this is some of these are just like they're not even worth keeping. I mean, this Capri is not bad because it came with uh, shrimp, but then there's no recovery. There's only resilience there. And this is what I'm talking about. Like a lot of this stuff is just like Bungie just throws it. I mean, a lot of, I don't know, man. Can we get like, uh, what was it again? We got in D1 where you can like re-roll exotics again. Uh, can we, can we get that material back? Can I like, you know, can we, can we get, the, you know, those back, you know, something for re-roll? Cause even if you farm for exotics, you're not guaranteed to get like what you want. And this is coming from someone that like, have obtained a lot of exotics in this game. Oh, these aren't too bad, actually. Mm. Oh, these car size are bad, actually. Recovery and strength. I guess if I really need exotic, I can like come find it and like throw it on when his guys aren't too bad either holy crap these actually came with like recovery and strength as well Ooh, look bro look how cracked these aeons are this is a 69 base right yeah that's yeah controverse holes do i have any like with crazy discipline it's not bad nope Sun bracers. Hey, these aren't too bad. A bunch of shrimp. <sighs> Ophidians. These are probably the best Ophidians I have. Hmm. 
Mm, I don't have a good pair of um, cars. I see. Titans. Do I have any with like a bunch of resilience? Oh, that's not too bad. Necrotic grips, terrible roll. I might need to go and farm for those actually. But yeah, a lot of these are just like balanced out distribution, man. It sucks. Look at this. What is this? Like, I don't know. I love Dragon Shadow. It's a great chess piece. I think the one that I use is on my character. All right. Maybe. I'm not sure. I do have exotics on my other characters that are not in here either. So I, I do know that some of the be better roles I do kind of keep there. Mm. Let's see here. Coyote. Well, this one has mobility and intellect on there, especially if I put Dan Dynamo with it. This wouldn't be too bad. This is even better. Ah. Hmm. Gwison. Well, ah, this one has intellect on there, but there's not too many of them. Recovery intellect. That's not too bad. Lucky Raspberry. Do I have any lucky raspberry with some good intellect or in discipline on there? Ah, oh, this one has good discipline, but no intellect. Man. That's not too bad. I use this hard ammo slide actually. So that's fine. Recovery into like strength now. Oh, this action war rig is actually nice. 2021, huh? Oh, this one's even nicer. Armatarium 23 discipline, 24 recovery. That's not too bad. Do I have a, a better armatarium? I think that was probably the best one. This one has, yeah, uh, there's only 17 discipline because I have the mod on. Storm Dancer Brace. Are we ever going to get to use this? Is Bungie ever going to patch this and make it maybe last a little bit longer? We'll see about that. Who knows? Vesper Radius. Sanguine. Yeah, a lot of these rules are just like subpar, man. Uh, I don't know. Not gonna lie to you. There's like none with some like crazy stats on them. Twenty nine recovery. Ah, oh, right, juice harness. This one's not bad, actually. Garden doesn't consume energy. Early deactivation for War One Garden. Hmm. better pair of lucky pants somewhere maybe i'm going crazy here nope ah this one's okay it has third recovery on it by itself uh 25 into like that's not bad orpheus rigs all I'm saying is when it comes to like making a build, a lot of this stuff is just, I don't know. I don't feel like it's worth it, but we'll see. Actually, if I took away, that's not too bad. That's not too bad either. Stompies. 
and then we got some jesters holy shit these jesters uh have a lot of mobility on them actually i mean that's what you're going to be using anyway for your uh for your dodge right exotics that i'm not going to use is the exotics that the game gives you like high stat on like look at this like what the fuck bro like what why this will actually go well with like gamblers dodge because you have your mobility and your strength as well I don't have any really good frosties and I think the one that I have I have on my character and not in the vault yeah a lot of these are just like they're okay <clears throat> this one's not too bad ramparts Mm, 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 mm. Recovery discipline. Oh, I used those before. Dune marchers. I have some stupid Dune marchers on my Titan and not in my vault. Yeah. Oh yeah, I used those. The other Lunas are like terrible. Geomags. I love these Geomags because they actually came with recovery and intellect. The rest are just, yeah. Traverses, they're not too bad. Bombardiers. Probably never going to use these, but you just never know, right? Might as well master work and leave it there. That's a lot of discipline on a fucking pair of bombardiers. Well, that's it. I mean, you, you basically saw the vault. I didn't have anything too crazy in there. The coolest thing is that they're all masterwork. And at some point, maybe Bungie would make it to where, like, I can delete some. Um, also, sunsetting is the reason why my vault doesn't really have any any weapons in it i had to delete a bunch of weapons you know you either delete it now or delete it later right so i got rid of it i'm i'm gonna be ready for next season uh and yeah i don't know what i'm you know now i'm i'm gonna get shards i'm probably gonna mass work stuff and then the rest is just gonna go in the dumps because i do a lot of help with gm so either way i'm gonna be getting shards out of the ass so you ask there goes my my vault all right i'll see you guys in the next video thank you for watching you know if you like this video for some reason make sure you hit the like and uh subscribe button that'd be awesome thank you